you know the club that I was speaking about called Open Ground opened up in this place called Wuppertal, which is near Cologne over there in Germany. It's a new actual club that I want to go to. I think it opened in December of last year, so it's fairly new. But a lot of people have been saying it has the best sound system of all clubs in Europe right now. And a lot of the people that have been saying this are people that I trust um, online and people that I just know from the scene who have been giving this place rave reviews. And because Berlin is, you know, it's kind of expensive to go to Berlin as much as I would love to go there as often as I did in the past because I was, you know, as you guys know on this particular pod, I talk enthusiastically about Berlin and Berghain all the time because I go there literally, you know, four times a year. But these times, I don't you know, last time I went there was probably like last year and this is a long time for me, mostly because it's so expensive. The flights are not too bad, but just the accommodation nowadays, like to get like your own place because usually i don't like to rent a room because you know i'm way too grown to be doing that and it feels uncomfortable to be in somebody's house when you're you're going to be raving and coming in all, all hours of the night i just feel a bit odd to be coming into somebody's home at like 4 a.m and creeping around with drinks it's just dumb so i prefer just to rent the whole apartment out but to rent a whole apartment out for the weekend in berlin is now like 400 euros plus in the past it was like 150 to 250 max now it's like 400 euros which is like come on bro that's like half of my rent do you know I mean? I'm not paying half of rent to go and fucking for a weekend somewhere else. It's fucking dumb. So this place called um, Open Ground in the city of Wuppertal in Germany is now looking like a new place to go to because it's a bit more cost effective. Um, and obviously the flights are fairly the same as Berlin, about 100 euros, whatever, if you book it ahead of time. And Airbnbs for the weekend for yourself, even in the city centre, are like maximum 200 euros, which is definitely what I can do. So I'm looking forward to going soon. So this is really good news. It says that Wuppertal Club Open Air reveals first for residents. So they've only just opened and they've already got their resident program on the desk. Um, I would really hope that a lot of UK clubs do this, but they don't. This is the way that DJs like myself, up and coming ones, get a chance to play at big clubs because they have a uh, resident DJ roster. And what resident DJ roster is meant to do is meant to be like, hey, every weekend, you know, these four DJs play from Thursday to Sunday and then they pepper it with guests. But what it does is that it gives the resident DJs a chance to play in front of a captive audience because the people coming are usually coming for the guests, but they also know that you're going to be there and you're going to play a particular standard. And then that helps to build you up, gets you to play in front of a crowd. And then later on, you can then become, you know, a bit of a fucking star in your own regard. So it's really important. But, you know, some venues don't do it, whatever. So um, Germany and other places in Europe still have that as a thing. This is why DJs are thriving over there. And people here are still fucking struggling to fucking kill one hour sets. Anyway, it continues. Whirlpool Club Open Ground has announced its first ever residence. The venue broke the news on Instagram last Friday, April 12th, confirming Josie Rebel, Fadi Mohem, Elk, and Tasha for residencies. The four dealers embody the spirit of the club. We invite you to join them with an open mind and share the great experience of the sound system in an inclusive venue. I'm really happy about it, mostly because Josie Rebel, she's a UK fucking legend, one of the best DJs we have here. Definitely a, an amazing export. Um, she's played a bunch of times at Berghain, really underrated, I think. Um, very very under the radar in terms of a sick DJ. So she's fucking incredible. So glad to see her get the role there. Fadi Home, I'm, I'm a big fan of. And Tasha, I've seen play once, I think, at a festival. But of course, really good people. Um, Open Ground um, has also, alongside residents, Open Ground has also booked the likes of Miss Yee, Zenka Brothers, Ski Mask, and Ben UFO, Malonke and D Bridge for the coming weeks. Occupying the converted bunker close to the city's main train station, Open Ground was launched last December by a team centering around the former hard work staff, Marcus Riedel. So yeah, those are the new residents there um you love to see it um good amount of like in what you call it a good amount of um diversity and inclusivity if that matters or anything it doesn't really to be honest but if it does matter it's cool to see in fadi moham's case i think he just he, he got announced as like bergheim resident recently and now you're also resident of open ground i'm not sure how that works can you be resident of two places at the same time i think you can who knows regardless great to see love it and i'm eager to go and check these guys out when they do eventually play maybe i'll maybe i will go end of the may if if Jez Rebel is playing end of May, maybe that's when I'll go. Maybe I'll check out Open Ground the end of May. Maybe that's when I'll check it out and see her playing there. And then maybe I'll also go back when Fadi Mohan plays. Maybe why not? Why not do the both double, 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 double? So that's definitely somewhere I'm looking forward to checking out. Big up Open Ground. Can't to check out the club. Can't wait to fucking check out the fucking club. 